you see all things as beautiful? Everyone can agree a rainbow is beautiful. Everyone can agree a rose with just a few drops of dew on its velvety petals is beautiful. But how can we see the things of the world as beautiful? You can't single-handedly try to convince yourself that every single thing you are looking at is individually beautiful. Because when taken individually, it's not all beautiful. I mean, there are just some things that aren't beautiful. And some of it's a matter of opinion, and some of it's sort of objectively agreed upon that certain things aren't beautiful. The only way is to see everything as divine. Because when you see everything as divine, then in everything you are seeing the loved one. And so for example, if you have a, a child, and that child goes to school and comes home from art class and has made you clay sculptures in their art class. But say your child is nine or 10 years old and they've made you a, or a cup or a bowl or who knows what it is. Well, to you, it's going to be beautiful because you love the artist. In the same way when your toddler makes scribbles on a piece of construction paper that look like nothing to everyone else, you love it because you love the artist. In the same way when your child decides to make you breakfast in bed and burns the toast and you know put salt instead of sugar into your coffee and nonetheless I mean it may be absolutely inedible but it's going to be beautiful to you because you love the chef that's the only way to see things of the world as beautiful, is to love the creator of the world and to realize that everything in the world has been created by and of the creator. And to see things, therefore, as by the beloved and find that love for the divine in your heart so that whatever you see you see it as a reflection of that divine. And then the whole world, regardless of its aesthetics, is beautiful.